big hello and a warm welcome to all of you amazing and beautiful people out there to my channel the twin flame union and in this channeling session i've been sent an, an amazing energy upgrade a wonderful tarot card has been sent to to me to relate to you guys the meaning and understanding in the context of this twin flame journey that you're going through as i know that a lot of you are on different levels all of you could be in different waves but your core feeling of love is the same therefore every single person out there needs this upgrade it's just like how you get upgrades on your phone and on your laptops the software upgrade similarly this is an energy upgrade and everyone must listen to it carefully and listening carefully itself will actually help you out a lot to download the upgrade now the reason is that this journey is completely based on surrender and faith and all the divine feminines obviously learn surrender and faith when they have really been badly rejected and they don't know what to do before that they try a lot of things reading talking to others or just um, fight or flight as i said fighting with the dm constantly trying to explain to him trying to convince him then stalking him chasing him all of that happens now if you still haven't reached the phase of final separation which is a long term separation i don't want to scare you guys but i also want to say that it's not necessary that everyone has to go through the same type of separation because not everyone also gets married to a karmic not everyone also gets into the false twin situation you know what i mean so you all have different levels and different types of twin flame situations and even the manifestation of the union is different for all of the people now i'm also going to share a video while i'm talking to you right now i'm sharing it um on the posting section it's called different types of sexualities and in the coming few days i will also share one more video which is about the types of twin flame unions so after doing a good amount of surrendering after understanding that faith is what helps you actually get into the union then the divine feminines understand that they need to increase their will power and they this particular card the magician is actually being shown to me a because it's an air element so air is very important in terms of your thoughts and the planet that it's ruled by is mercury which is a very fast moving planet it's very fast moving planet and it has a lot of energy because it is very close to the sun so this magician card also talks about manifestation which means that it helps people in manifesting their union or their intentions but as we go further up in the twin flame ascension journey we understand and this is primarily for the divine feminines that your union with the source is actually going to manifest into the union with the divine masculine because you and the divine masculine are the same you are the same exact people the same exact dna template so when you heal you have actually created healing for the dm and this is why this whole mirroring thing happens in the twin flame journey so anything you do even if you have intentions even if you are manifesting something there is a word in hindi called karm yog karm yog please google it and you can see the meaning of it when i was in shivananda ashram for some time the meaning uh, this word karma yoga was used a lot everywhere because karma yoga they they used to say it karma yoga and in hindi it's karm so i am saying karm yog so karma yoga is basically what a lot of seekers also practice because we are householders we are not sanyasis we are not monks we have not left the world and neither is it it is recommended for you to do that okay you are you are being recommended to live in the household holders journey and karma yoga means 
where whatever actions you do you know you have to dedicate it to the source you don't have to really care about the results you don't have to really care about what happens you just have to flow in the form of surrender so obviously then surrender and karma yoga is connected but it can only get connected if you stop thinking of when it will happen how it will happen this and that you just have to do your duties as a human being whatever you have been designated to and the magician is also coming as a very positive sign for all of all of you people who are probably confused or you're thinking that am i doing the right thing or not am i in the right direction or not so yes you are because the magician card is a divine card it's very important card it's a very 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 positive card so it has Uh, been shown to me right now as an answer to all of the divine feminines who are confused if they are walking on the right path or not the magician has a lot to do with important communication and as i have been noticing that on my channel especially on my community i have mostly people who are in the final stages of the union sorry of the journey and it's amazing how so many of you are automatically getting drawn to these channelings and to all the video messages and all the information videos that i'm sharing because it is the time of ascension on planet earth especially in 2020 it got totally kick started you know like it's in it's on the rocket launcher but then some of you even if you're in communication with your dms as you have been telling me those of you i am coaching have been telling me and a lot of you have been writing comments to me i know some of you are also in no contact situation and you feel disheartened when you read the comments of the people who are in communication or when i talk about this thing that yes some of you are in communication and for my own personal self also i would say the same thing that i learned most of this twin flame uh, information all of this knowledge was passed on to me when i started becoming more and more focused on my mission work and that happened around 4 to 5 years back when i was like okay i am done with this on and off this runner and chaser this and that you know i i don't have time for this frankly i was getting very tired of this and i learned that you find so much peace and contentment and so much joy when you let go and you are having a great time you know be it at the beach be it in the mountains be it in the ashrams be it at home be it at with animals be it while doing your work when you let go it also happens when your intuition becomes stronger so meditation is very 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 important now since i've been shown important communication that's the word i've been given important communication it definitely means that even though you guys have been talking to one another he messaged you or you messaged whosoever started that that doesn't matter but somehow you're talking to one another and he has expressed this feeling to you that he always wanted to be with you but since things did not work out you know he chose another path this card is also about confidence so i've been told that this is a confidence upgrade as well which means that a lot of you divine feminine after listening to this particular channeling will feel very confident about themselves and when you're confident about yourself you really don't care when things will happen how things will happen all you know is that things will happen and it will all work out fine and you go by your day and throughout the day you keep checking yourself and you are so aware of your own thoughts because the air element is very prominent in this reading so air is equal to thoughts so you will be very aware of your thoughts what type of thoughts are putting me down and what type of thoughts i need to just witness just witness and let them go i don't need to fight with those thoughts those thoughts i don't need to you know run away from those thoughts i just simply need to be in the present moment i need to be connected to my breath and i need to be connected to the source and i just need to keep doing my chores my job my work and most importantly mission the divine feminines also need an energy upgrade in skills because you need to got need to have skills 
the biggest skill that you need to have is to differentiate between people who bring you up and those people who bring you down now if you're in the narcissistic family template you should know very well who all are going to bring you down with their words with their remarks so one of the most important thing to do in the narcissistic template is to not have any emotional connection with anyone because if you will have emotional connection with them then th their words are going to be like poisonous arrows you know the words are literally like poisonous arrows and they will you know just the arrows will go straight into your heart and it will really hit you badly and you will be down but if you if you're not emotional at all you will look at them you will listen to them and you'll be like blah 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 <laughs> you will keep doing your work and that's very very important then magician is also about fun you got to have a lot of fun when you're doing this journey you can't be like you know sad and depressed and i know and i know by my own experience it's not that i'm not experiencing some of the difficulties or challenges there are levels of challenges and there are levels of difficulty so whenever you have those difficult moments you got to see the fun side of it if you're going to take it too seriously then it will probably consume you that seriousness so you got to see it from the fun perspective and you got to find solutions in whatever you do now this type of reading is obviously different than the tarot reading the regular tarot reading because this is also specially designed for the twin flame ascension journey now the magician card is has many meanings in different context but here i've been told to channel it exactly the way i'm channeling to you right now so i just want you to remember one thing there's one more word that is being sent to me and this is again for the divine masculine and divine feminine because at this point in time even the divine masculine is getting this upgrade so why are you he is getting that upgrade please understand that and that is the most important thing to understand magician is a very powerful energy and he will feel that energy because he con continuously has been feeling that he lacks the skills to get back to you he has been really feeling very bogged down because you know that i have done the channeling for the dark night of the souls and all the other cards he has been really feeling down and depressed and he has been like what the hell did i do all the mistakes i made so even those of you who are in communication with your masculine even you you also and this is a good thing that you did by the way so don't regret it you also very clearly told him that look things cannot work out the way you were trying to work it out i have certain terms and conditions and this is how it's going to happen from now onwards because i am the house i am the lady of the house i am the boss here okay so please kindly cooperate with me because since i let things happen according to you in the past we know where we are it didn't really work out because i was so awestruck and mesmerized by you now <clears throat> the divine feminine doesn't have to be you know in the superiority complex mode but she has to know that she is the lady of the house and she needs to take certain important decisions and she cannot always let him take all the decisions and especially for those of you who are serious about your mission work i know some of you are working in the health uh area i know some of you are working in the environment i know some of you are working in the ministries some of you are working in businesses a lot of you are doing great things for the planet so you got to now understand that your time on planet earth is precious and as a magician you will have all the elements that you need to make your mission a success and it does not become successful in one day it's not like you you know put the seed today in the ground in the soil and today itself you will have a fruit tree and you will start eating the fruits no you have to enjoy the process of growing that tree and that is why you have been sent to planet earth because in your previous galaxies wherever you've come from or in your previous places in your other dimensions some of you in fact most of you are star seeds so you can resonate with this even those who are humans who have always been humans let me tell you human beings are very powerful very very powerful because they are the part of the same source they are the speck of light of the source so you don't even know how powerful you are okay but to reach to your point of power you have to first raise your human consciousness 
Human consciousness is a very cool consciousness because humanity is about being in the middle path. Human beings are people who can be good and bad both depending on the situation. Like for example, the angelic people, they cannot do anything bad because they're angels. Or the people who are fallen angels, they cannot do anything good because they're fallen angels. So they keep creating problems for everyone. Now, the line that I received in this channeling, other than the tarot card, because tarot card is not the only thing I received during channelings. Along with this, it also said to me repeatedly, Ek se bhale do. 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 And it's a Hindi statement again, so I will translate it for you all. It means... Two are better than one. 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 So, couple of years back, when I was leaving the city, I was actually doing something big for that time and it wasn't an easy decision. And basically, I was moving from Delhi to Bombay and it was a big shift of my career, big shift of, I was taking many risks. And that point in time, I was told by a traveler, but the message was sent to me via a, another traveler. And this other person also used to do readings and all that. So he told me and that, Ek se bhale do, ek se bhale do, ek se bhale do, ek se bhale do. And then my life changed completely. And two days back, I think it was Diwali only, in the morning, the same message was repeated to me. Same message. Can you believe it? Same statement, same line. And I knew that just the way this statement has changed my life, it will change other people's lives too. The reason is because that big leap of faith that I took, love had a lot to do with that. One love especially. Now, I will explain to you why in this channeling, this has been told that two are better than one, two are better than one, two are better than one and how does it imply? So, this is part one. I, so, I will meet you again soon in the part two of the same channeling. Ek se bhale do. One love and peace out.